Anatomy of Radius and Ulna The radius and ulna are two long bones in the forearm of the human body, forming the skeletal structure between the elbow and the wrist. Let's delve into their anatomy. Radius Location, the radius is located on the lateral, thumb, side of the forearm when the palm is facing forward. Shape It is a long bone that is slightly curved and wider at its proximal, near the elbow, end. Proximal end The proximal end of the radius articulates with the humerus, upper arm bone, and the ulna at the elbow joint. Distal end the distal end of the radius articulates with the carpal bones of the wrist. Head The proximal end has a round head that articulates with the capitulum of the humerus. Styloid process The distal end has a bony projection called the styloid process, which helps stabilize the wrist joint. Interosseous membrane The radius is connected to the ulna by the interosseous membrane, a fibrous tissue that helps maintain the relationship between the two bones. Ulna. Location, the ulna is located on the medial, pinky finger, side of the forearm when the palm is facing forward. Shape. It is also a long bone, longer and more slender than the radius, with a slight curvature. Proximal end. The proximal end of the ulna articulates with the humerus and the radius at the elbow joint. Distal end of the distal end of the ulna forms part of the wrist joint and articulates with the radius and the carpal bones. Olecranon process. The proximal end of the ulna features a prominent bony projection called the olecranon process, which forms the bony prominence of the elbow. Coronoid process. Another projection on the proximal end, it is located anteriorly and fits into the fossa of the humerus when the elbow is flexed. Styloid process. Similar to the radius, the ulna also has a styloid process at its distal end. Interactions in function. The radius and ulna work together to enable forearm rotation and wrist movements. Radius primarily bears the weight of the forearm, while the ulna acts as a stabilizer and helps transmit forces from the hand to the elbow. Interactions in function. Ligaments and muscles attach to both bones, aiding in the movement and stability of the forearm and wrist.